Hello everybody, this is Zelda Maniac 1994 and welcome to a new series. We're doing Super Smash Bros. Brawl, the Subspace Emissary. And uh let's just hop right in. We're gonna <laughs> We're gonna be um playing on intense. Uh <coughs> cuz I'm a nut. Um But I figured it'd be kinda fun. And uh little behind the scenes uh information. I actually have already recorded the uh, first episode of this. However, I was playing out on the Wii U and I couldn't use my GameCube controller. That was the first problem. So I was using a controller adapter, not an adapter, but a, uh, a fight pad for my Wiimote. It's very similar to a GameCube controller, but it doesn't do the same. And uh, the other problem was I had the game audio too high and my voice audio was not high enough in comparison uh i'm better with mario uh so it just turned out to be a mess so i figured you know what might as well restart playing on the wii so i have an actual gamecube port um so we're all good now thing is i'm not uh i'm a little bit out of practice with Brawl. I'm much more uh, familiar with uh, Smash 4. I used to play Brawl quite a lot back when it first came out. Or first was out. You know, whatever. Um, me and Black Team 900 would spend hours upon hours playing this game. Um, but it's just, you know, the game's aged quite a bit. It's not as good as it used to be. Um, oh goodness gracious. I am not good at this. Uh, I don't know what am I saying? Anyway, it, it's a bit more clumsy than Smash 4, but I really enjoyed the Emissary, and I really enjoyed playing Brawl back then. I thought it was a lot of fun. Oh, that awesome Smash. That Meteor Smash, though. But, the Subspace Emissary, I think, was a... Uh, I think the best part about Smash Brothers as a whole was... What I just said, the Emissary. Uh, basically this gigantic story mode that weaved all these uh, characters into one gigantic over uh, arcing world and plot and it's all done through no dialogue it's quite amazing um, it can come off as a bit contrived at first um, but you know all stories do don't they I mean all good ones but, uh, the emissary is a lot of fun. I actually remember staying up one night when it was, uh, when I was younger. I remember staying up all night, uh, just playing through the emissary. And by all night, I mean, like, I was, like, I started playing it, I think, at, at 7 p.m. And I was, like, up till, like, 7 a.m. or 8 a.m. And I, like, finally beat the emissary. I'm a little better result of it. Mario. Um, anyway, I sit up all night playing the Suspect Emissary, and oh, I loved it so much. I love Brawl so much. Oh, this is not Smash 4 Zelda. Obviously. And boy, I cannot wait until uh, Smash Bros. for Switch comes out. That's going to be a whole lot of fun. I hope. <laughs> well, I don't see why it wouldn't be. <laughs> but you never know. Yeah, I hear. Wow, where all that come from? Stop killing me. I wish I could just be a little bit better at this game. I'm also, I, I just started playing on intense, so, uh, not, I, I'm not sure what's wrong with me. I just like doing crazy, stupid, hard stuff. Uh, just for kicks. Get out of here. You too. Oh boy. You too. Would you stop? Get out of here. Oh boy. This is turning a bit messy. Oh, oh. 
Uh oh. It's getting rough. Oh, this is not for the faint of heart. Okay, we got Kirby. Let's see if I can, uh. Let's see if I can just cheese this battle a little bit. Yeah, here. Alrighty. We're doing okay so far. Not bad for intense. Honestly, that'll be doing a little bit worse, but, you know. Ancient Minister. And, uh, Smash Bros. Brawl is, like, I think one of the least favorite Smash Bros. games at this point. Uh, and it's pretty much because of the game mechanics. It's definitely not as fast as other Smash Bros. games. Um, and there's a tripping mechanic, which... The tripping mechanic is just... I don't know. It's so stupid. I'm not really sure why that would be an in-game mechanic when you just, you know, you're running and you just randomly trip. I mean, alright. I don't get it. But... Okay. Well, you know, I'm gonna save my girl Zelda. If I could, uh, save myself first. This is going to be a bit rough. Oh boy. Just got to play it safe. Oopsie, that's not safe. Oh, sweet. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not sure what that was about. There we go. Peach's cage has been broken. Peach is... Not Peach. Zelda's cage was broken. And Zelda is now safe. Good. As she should be. Oh, Mario. What you gonna do? That big old gun. Oh, sure. Just target the uh, helpless peach over here. She, she just got out of her cage. Come on now. We weren't even ready for that. Well, he's got his trophy. And he's out of here. Oh, bomb. And they got away safely, but... If anyone else was there, they didn't. Well, that looks like it's gonna be fun. For someone else, we don't have to deal with it at all, which is good. Stage clear. Kirby, join your team. Zelda, join your team. Good, 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 good. Empty. Let's just save our progress. Alright. Well, anyways, guys, that's gonna cover for this episode. Thank you all so very much for watching. This is Zelda Maniac 1994 signing out.